Hi guys! If you're watching this video, then you probably have problems with your AOF UI and you probably, well, haven't tried everything yet, like I did. For, well, since the beginning of the pre-patch, I've been having a problems with my AOF UI. When I enter into the add-ons, I enable it and I press reload UI, everything I see is, well, nothing. The add-on doesn't load at all. It's enabled, but nothing happens. There is no action bars. There is nothing when you press escape. There is, you cannot find it in the add-on interface tab, but it's actually activated from the add-ons. First thing you need to do is go into your WoW folder, then into retail, if I read it correctly, then interface, add-ons. In here you need to find Elf UI add-on. Here it is. Then you need to delete everything. After we deleted the add-on and everything related to it, older and newer versions, whatever, you need to come to the site. Link will be in the description below. Here you can pick on the main page. You can see download Elf UI and the version. In case you are not late to that page, you need to go to add-ons, Elf UI, and then download the current one or the class. So we're coming here, we're selecting the version we need. The downloading will not start directly. We need to scroll down here and click this button here. I normally like to open with and then open. You can either select them and drag them to the folder that the add-ons are located, then drop them there. Or you can extract them to the folder that you need. Or you can take the var file, place it into the folder with add-ons, then right click and extract there. So after we got the add-on, we are entering into the game and we need to activate it. There should be only two options, Elf UI and Elf UI Options UI. After we activate it and reload, everything should be fine and dandy. There could be some things off. For example, this bar should not be there. So you can just toggle and move them the way you like. So that's how we fix it, guys. I bet many of you have done this thing first. Okay, maybe second, if it's not fixed after the update. But me being lazy and trying not to lose my settings, I kept updating and updating and updating and it didn't work, so I just decided it will not get fixed until I decided to delete it and download the one from the site because as far as I know, Twitch is no longer gonna be uh, updating the add-ons from Curse. And I thought that might be the problem, so I just went to, to the site, downloaded them and replaced them and it actually fixed the problem. So thank you so much for watching. If you find this video useful, make sure you let me know by liking, comment and subscribe. If you haven't, we are aiming for 1000 subscribers, so that will really help me. Thanks for watching again and see you next time. Bye bye guys.